Greg Michael, and I just played for you the nasty rhyme called Aunt Polly. As usual, I based my version on a very famous and appreciated Mr. Tumble. We love Mr. Tumble and his TV show called Something Special, available on CBBS here in the UK or on YouTube anywhere in the world. Before you get started learning the song, consider subscribing to my YouTube channel and hit the bell button in order to be notified about the future videos. I'll be posting videos about playing songs on electric guitar and acoustic guitar. At the moment I'm doing nursery rhymes because I'm a new parent and I'm trying to entertain my son as much as I can. And if you don't have children yet, then maybe those videos will be relevant to you in the future when you have them. So if you are not interested, uh, not uh, stay in touch because you know very soon I'll be posting videos that might be something that you like to learn. Okay, uh, uh, one more thing, uh, the code sheet to this lesson will be available on my website, uh, so I'll be placing the links to my website and to products I used in order to shoot this video, so everything will be in the description under the video, so check it out. Uh, so let's get started with learning the song. Uh, the first chord is G major, and to grab it you need those two fingers, and they go to fret 3 of string 6 with the second finger, fret 2 with the first finger on string 5, your ring finger goes on fret 3 string 2, and uh, pinky goes on string 1 fret 3, so that's the sound you want. The next chord D major is made of this shape, so you have first finger going on fret 2 of string 3, Second finger goes on string one, fret two, and the ring finger goes on fret uh, three, string two. I play five strings because I like the full sound of the major chord. Now, one thing to say is that when I'm changing from G major to D major, I keep my pinky down, so that way the chord change is easier. Okay, so you go. There's another chord there, and it was C major. So to grab C major, you need your ring finger on fret three, string five. Your second finger on string two, sorry, on string four, fret two. First finger goes on fret uh, one, string two, and play five strings, excluding the sixth string. Okay, so so you go one, two. be kind of more beginner friendly version. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Or down, down, up. One more time. Down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, down. And one more time. Down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, down. And let it ring. And then the chords of the verse are Major, followed by D major, stay on D major for another bar and go to G major for one bar, then G major, one bar, then D major for another bar, back to G major for one bar and then back to D major, followed by one bar where you go G, C, G, just like in the intro. So I'll do very basic strumming, which is one, two, three, four, 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 one, two, three, four. I'm not strumming on four. But you can obviously. More intermediate way of playing this song would be to do this strumming pattern that goes like that. Down, down, up, 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 down. Which, which is one, two, and three, four, and one. Something 
that out. Okay, uh, go to my website, download the course sheet, and it will be much easier to follow. Okay, so I hope that this uh, lesson was helpful, and if you are interested in uh, more lessons, you know, just 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 stay in touch by you know, subscribing to my YouTube channel. Feel free to hit the like button if you like the video because it will help me a lot. And if you place the comment with your suggestions or about whatever you want to learn in the future, I'll be very happy to, to shoot some videos uh, to help you out. Okay, so for now, take care and I will see you soon. Bye bye.